for a minute? Mm -hmm. All right, you guys, so you saw how matted JB's hair was, and that's only after a week. I now wash JB's hair once a week in the kitchen sink. Um, he is a little bit older, so it's not so hard, but I do have several other videos from when he was a toddler all the way to four and five years old. He's now seven, turning eight soon. So I'm actually going to be starting off with detangling his hair. I'm going to be using a Sultanicals deep conditioner to detangle his hair. J.B.'s hair is extremely dense. He has my density, yes. It is very, very coarse, not necessarily coarse, but dense. So I start off by applying warm water, and this is the deep conditioner, um, and I finger detangle. Now you will see me use a comb here later on when I add the conditioner, but he's not necessarily tender headed, but he will complain. So I try to finger detangle as much as possible. products on JV's hair. Hair is hair. Unless your child has any type of medical issues or is fairly young, I use the same products on my hair that I use on his hair. Now look, honey, I am cutting quite a bit of his hair off. I'm trying to do it while he's while he doesn't notice it because JB does want his hair long, but it is becoming a chore. I'm like, look, we both can't have a lot of hair, so your hair has to go. <laughs> So anyway, I'm going to go ahead and shampoo, look at all this hair, girl. I'm going to go ahead and shampoo his hair using Cream of Nature. Um, I'm also going to use Coconut Suave uh, for the conditioner. So yeah, y'all, no special products for him. Um, now, I will say, I know this is kind of bad, but oftentimes, if I'm not sure about a product, I will try it out on his hair first or a combination for a wash and go. I will try it on his hair first before trying it on my, on my hair, and he's okay with that, being my little guinea pig. So, I'm just going ahead and washing off that shampoo, then I'm going to apply the conditioner, and yeah. <music> his hair with the Jane Carter revitalizing leave-in spray. I typically don't do that, but since I will be styling his hair today, I figured I would. I'm adding the generic version of that Curl Enhancing Smoothie I got from Sally. Still have tons of that. I was a little heavy-handed with this product, but that's okay. 
I try to uh, moisturize his hair two to three times a week, but it can be a struggle because he's running around. This is a close-up of what his curls look like, and I'm going to try to attempt finger coils this time. All right, you guys, so I'm going to be sectioning JB's hair off, and we're going to be doing finger coils. I'm going to be using Wet Line Extreme Gel. This is going to take me a while. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right, so this is how I basically do finger coils. It's hard to do, so hold still, baby. So I basically am coiling it like this. And we can see what it looks like here. We're going to go ahead and dry his hair. All right, so I'm going to be taking some clippers and just cleaning his edges up a little bit. I actually used to be able to keep his hair trimmed, honey, after looking at several YouTube videos. But hey, this is the best we could do for now. Um, and then I'm also going to blow dry his hair. I will allow his hair to air dry after a while because he won't sit still for this. And this is <laughs> it basically, I have to allow it to dry. Once it dry, the product will dry clear and I'll show a, show you guys what it looks like when it's dry. You, he's so silly. Put your head down. <laughs> Put your head. Oh, mercy, my child is big. <laughs> Just as big as hold still, sweetheart. We get a close up of all his little curls. He's so cute. Mm. Etched him up, and mm. yeah, oh. I took up quite a bit of oh hair God. off. But oh look, oh. that hair will grow back by next week. Like, not even kidding. His hair grows so fast. <laughs> so this is what his hair looks like. He's so cute. Um, I will again restyle and wash within another week. Thank you so much for watching. Take care. Bye.